The season opener for the Red Bull Cliff Diving World Series 2013 is on the west coast of France in a picturesque city called La Rochelle. The historical St. Nicholas Tower is the setting for the 27.5 metre platform and one of the most challenging tour stops with high winds and cold conditions. In round one, after the first day, all of the divers are coping extremely well with the high winds, but Gary Hunt, the reigning champ from 2012, is now in the lead. Hey, it's windy, it's cold. It's La Rochelle, baby. Wow, the sun came out in event day and we had a huge crowd, 70,000 people, and that's a great thing for the divers. They can really feel the energy from the crowd and that helps lift their performance. And in third place, and his first time on the podium, Blake Aldridge. He was absolutely ecstatic with his performance. He had some great entries, cutting through the water like a knife. He really deserved that third place. This is the first stop, and, uh, and I dive great. So uh, I'm absolutely over the moon, and hopefully I can continue and get better and better as the series goes on. And in second place, the reigning 2012 champion, Gary Hunt. A super consistent performance there, and uh, he's definitely going to be a powerhouse in the competitions to come. And the winner, Artem Silchenko. This guy is in physically great shape, mentally good shape. You can see it in his eyes. He was hungry. He was ready. He used the energy from the crowd, and he truly deserved this win here today. I'm happy. I dive fourth time in the Australian. I never come on podium. Never. And every time I more back every time when I, I win here, no words. Wow, what an event. New faces on the podium for the first time. A huge crowd, 70,000 enthralled spectators. An event filled with drama, ups and downs, and we cannot wait to see what's going to happen at the next tour stop of the Red Bull Cliff Diving World Series 2013 in Denmark.